thank you so much for taking the time to tune into this video and if you are new to my channel welcome 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 <laughs> low-key i am actually out of breath right now because hubs and i literally just got back from dollar tree and i decided to run up the stairs and hurry up and film this haul video for you guys right before we eat a little bit of dinner because i'm so excited about this purchase i feel like it's been a long time since i last went to the dollar tree which isn't really true i think the last time i went was like last week or two weeks ago but i usually like to go to different dollar trees like throughout the week because they're always constantly bringing in new items so i just i feel like it's been a while since i've had my dollar tree fix so i was able to get that in today and it just makes me so happy like i love the dollar tree i seriously love the dollar tree my mom and i love the dollar tree and we are all about watching dollar tree haul videos so basically today i'm sorry i'm like fidgeting with my face a lot and my eyeglasses but I'm really excited about today's video specifically because it is majority a hygiene haul. I do have a couple of things here that aren't really hygiene related, but you know, when you go into the Dollar Tree for like a few things, you can never just come out with those few things. Like you always come out with other stuff, you know? It's like the equivalent of Target, as I like to say. But I did ask you guys in a community tab post if you wanted to see more hygiene related videos aside from Victoria's Secret and Bath and & Body Works. And a lot of you guys responded yes which makes me so excited. I'm really, 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 really happy that you guys welcome this type of content. But without further ado, like I said, we are gonna be eating dinner soon, so I do wanna get through these quickly, but hopefully like not too quickly, you know? So the first couple things here are actually not hygiene related. <laughs> um, Hubs actually picked these up because I have mentioned that I do like to grab him some Lunchables. I like to keep a good stock of these in the fridge for him because he loves taking these to work. It's like a quick work lunch type of thing. So usually whenever I go to the grocery store or Target, Walmart, Dollar Tree, I always pick up some sort of Lunchables. So we actually bought three but he already got into the other one so i do have two here to share with you guys this is the pepperoni pizza from the lunch makers armor brand and it looks like this you do get a crunch bar as your dessert if you will okay so i just rummaged through these bags really really quick and from what i've seen the rest of this stuff is hygiene related so yay, yay! <laughs> so this first item i'm really excited to try this you guys like i've never ever tried this before and i have been obsessed obsessed with watching chloe yasmin's hygiene channel i love her oh my goodness she is so down to earth and just so amazing she's 16 years old she's a woman of god and it's so nice to see someone that age be a woman of god but also have like a successful youtube channel and just you know her doing her own thing and it's just so 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 nice to see that but basically she put me on this and i was like okay sis i need to go ahead and try this out so this is the exfoliating washcloth basically what this is it's a really long washcloth and it's from what i'm feeling here it's abrasive but it's not too too abrasive to the point where you know it's going to be damaging to your skin uh, but it just feels really really nice so i cannot wait to go ahead and and try this out i already took my shower for the day so i'm just gonna go ahead and try this out tomorrow but oh my goodness you guys it feels amazing and to have this at the dollar tree i am all for it so i went ahead and i grabbed one of those to go ahead and give a try okay and hubs actually picked these two out and i'm so 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 excited i love when we go out shopping and he just you know tends to like grab his own things because i'm like oh my goodness like that makes me so happy and i don't i don't know why <laughs> so he picked out the power stick four in one wash charcoal body wash and it looks like this this is actually the bonus 50 percent more size so this is 18 fluid ounces and he actually got two of these like i always mention in my videos hubs goes through body wash like super quick <laughs> like really really quick and they must smell good i actually didn't get to smell these yet yeah, they actually smell pretty good. They smell really refreshing and really strong. So I'm really excited for him to go ahead and try these out. These are made in the USA and it's a four-in-one. So it's a shower, shave, shampoo, and condition. I watched... Oh, I'm forgetting her name. Oh my goodness, I feel so bad. But I watched someone's review, like Dollar Tree review, and she reviewed this and she said that her husband loved it. So as soon as she said that, I was like, it must be good. So I'm really excited that he went ahead and got these. What I decided to do is for, you know, hygiene products that are not Bath & Body Works or Victoria's Secret, I'm still gonna be saving them. But I think what I'm gonna do is I'm just going to be making like 
an overall hygiene empties video so it's still like a non bath and body works empties video type of thing but just like an empties video so i can tell you guys about the products and review them also so this is going to be in that as soon as he finishes those up and then the last product in here he also got this this is also from power stick this is the beard bomb and it controls smooths and styles tames unruly hairs and it has argan oil and almond oil so he went ahead and picked this up as well he was like oh this sounds interesting let me go ahead and try it and i don't know if you guys follow me on instagram because i haven't made a video of hubs in a while but if you follow me on instagram on my stories you'll see that he actually grew out a beard <laughs> and it's really like thick and so he went ahead and got this just to you know like tame it and make it not as rough from what i remember they also had a beard wash and then this beard bomb but he decided to just grab the beard bomb so it says that you should use this with the beard wash but he just went ahead and grabbed this one okay so in this next bag we have more goodies so i found this this is the village naturals therapy brand and it says aches and pains muscle relief concentrated mineral bath soak powerful therapeutic blend for muscle and joint discomfort sore tired feet on the go relief and it has epsom salt menthol and spearmint and it looks like this packaging here if you can see that so this is what the packaging looks like and i've actually never seen this before this is the first time that i am seeing this and it says it is manufactured in the usa and it has not been tested on animals um so i actually picked up two of these for hubs's pedicures i absolutely absolutely adore giving him pedicures like weekly i love it and he loves it as well <laughs> so whenever i see things that are pedicure appropriate i usually always grab them so these are little like epsom salt packets that you can just toss in your little pedicure spa or if you don't have a spa even if you just have like a big bowl that you fill up with water just sprinkle like a packet or half a packet of this in it just to act as like a soak like a foot soak so i'm really excited to go ahead and try these out and he is as well next thing i got this is actually like well i guess this is kind of hygiene related i just needed a pack of these lens wipes for my eyeglasses and they look like this they're individual wipes and they come in a pack of 12 and i don't know if this is the best value because you do get 12 in here for a dollar i don't know if it's just better to buy these in bulk at walmart or online at costco like some sort of wholesale place i don't know but i needed them and they were there so i just went ahead and i grabbed these i've been mentioning in like the past few videos that my glasses they like fog and they get dirty really easily like i don't know if you can tell probably not but like even now the frame is like really really dirty and I don't know how they get so dirty I think it's because like I have oily skin and because like these glasses they technically don't match my face in the sense that they don't stay that's why in my videos I'm constantly like pushing them up because they always slide down but I knew that when I was purchasing the style so it's not my optometrist's fault or anything like that like this is just a style that I wanted um, but whenever I push them back it like hits my eye and I feel like this bottom part it hits the skin like underneath here so I feel like that's why they get oily and dirty easily so I just needed these I also picked up a pack of bobby pins this is the pack of 72 bobby pins I needed bobby pins because I forgot mine at home and I just like to keep an extra set of stuff while I'm here just so I'm not remembering all the time to bring stuff from my house to here you know what I mean so I needed bobby bobby pins because I've been wanting to put my hair up in a nice messy bun but I can't because I don't have bobby pins so that's why I went ahead and I grabbed those. Hubs actually picked this one up. We have been in desperate need of chapstick and like I said I have a ton of chapsticks at home but I forgot to bring them here and in my past couple videos I said that I was in dire need of chapstick and let me just show you guys. This is the one that Hubs had on hand. It's extremely dirty because this is in his work outfit so it's dirty but like that's all i have like i don't know if you're seeing that but like it's literally nothing so with that being said we needed to pick up on some chapstick so hubs picked this one up this is the hostess cupcakes flavored lip balm 
and it looks like this and he just loves cute little stuff like this and then I went ahead and I grabbed this one I have never seen this one before this is the first time that I'm seeing it this is the salt range Himalayan pink salt lip balm moisturizing cherry and shea butter and it comes with two sticks and that's why I went ahead and I wanted to get this one because it comes with two and you know like two for the price of a dollar it's 50 cents each but yeah I've never seen this one so this is from the salt range brand I guess and it's part of the WBM foundation actively promotes a pollution free environment and I mean it seems local because it says here there's a Flemington New Jersey address here so it seems local but yeah I wanted to go ahead and give this one a try and because like I said I've never seen it before until now and also the fact that it is cherry and shea butter so I'm really intrigued to see what that smells like actually let me just go ahead and open it right now because I'm really curious to see what this smells like okay so this is what it looks like it's pretty plain like if you look at the label here I'm trying to zoom in on it so if you look at the label the whole stick is basically white like you only have that front label there it's not like an entire wraparound but I mean that doesn't matter it doesn't really smell like much like I guess you get a light light like a very very light light cherry scent which I'm not mad about because I'm not a cherry person like I really really don't like cherry oh but it feels good yeah it feels good granted I did just put on the Nivea chapstick so but this one feels good when you apply it so I'm really curious to see how it's gonna work. I also picked up a pack of these Plackers floss picks. I love these. I will not floss with anything else except these. Not specifically this brand and this particular like kind, but I always need the floss picks. I don't like flossing with the actual like regular floss, but these you get 60 in here and I always get my floss picks at the Dollar Tree. It's just the best value in my opinion. So this is a brand new item. I've never seen this one before at the Dollar Tree. These are both from the Qtex brand and if you guys don't know Qtex, they make nail polish removers and I think they make other like nail accessories. So I got this one. This is the hand and cuticle cream all in one 24 hydration 24 hour hydration excuse me dermatologist tested and it's the sweet almond oil fragrance um yeah so this is a hand and cuticle cream so this is what this looks like and I think this would be really really perfect for manicures and then also they had the matching foot cream and it's moisture rich hydrates and softens and this one is in the grapefruit fragrance grapefruit fragrance <laughs> so I basically just got these two and they look like that if you can find these two together you could make a really really nice Mother's Day gift set just from the Dollar Tree just pick these two up and then they have a bunch of different like nail accessories that you can just put together in a little gift basket and there you go you have a little like pampering Mother's Day gift this one I'm really excited again to try on Hubs's pedicures and also my pedicures as well because I do give myself pedicures obviously so I actually also purchased a lot of different bar soaps because I grew up on bar soap and it wasn't until I hit how old was I like some age in the teen years that I started using body wash instead of bar soap but I did grow up on bar soap and my parents till this day they still use bar soap so I kind of forgot how good bar soap felt in the sense of how clean it actually makes you um, and I do have a few bar soaps left from couponing and they're the Dove ones the go fresh cucumber one and so that's the one that I'm currently using in the shower and it's just so so nice so when I was at the Dollar Tree I went ahead and I grabbed a couple more this one is the Dove sensitive skin so this one is actually fragrance free and it's hypoallergenic so this is for sensitive skin this is also good for as Chloe Yasmin says your downstairs area it doesn't irritate you or anything like that because it is meant for sensitive skin and it's just like a really really nice way to clean her so this one I went ahead and I got to try and then I also got this one this is part of the sugar soap works brand and this is made in the USA and it's the oatmeal and coconut soap and it looks like 
this here. They had another one too. It was the oatmeal and verbena soap. But I just decided to get this one, the oatmeal and coconut one. And I really, really cannot wait to go ahead and give this one a try. And this is another bar soap from the same brand, from the Sugar Soap Works brand. This one is the Charcoal Eucalyptus Plant-Based Sulfate and Paraben Free. And it's also vegan bar soap. So this is what this one looks like. And again, it's from the same brand as this one, the Sugar Soap Works. This one is also made in the USA. And then I think this is the last bar soap that I got. This one is from Bolero and this is the Jasmine and Orange Blossom Bar Soap. And this is also plant-based and it's for all skin types. And this one is also made in the USA. And this is what this looks like. Now I know Bolero is a huge huge bath and body brand at the Dollar Tree like they've been coming out with amazing products. The only reason why I don't haul them and why I don't purchase them for myself aside from the bar soap is that they are made in China and I'm just someone who has always been you know particular about where my products are made especially if I'm either ingesting them or if they're going on my skin. I'm just always like really particular about that I've always been that way it was just how I was raised my mom is very like specific about that and she kind of just like drilled it into my head from what I've seen the bolero bar soaps are the only products in their whole line that is made in the USA and then I got a few face masks I do have a lot of face masks at my house but I decided to grab a few more because I don't have any face masks here and I meant to bring some from my house and then I forgot so I decided to go ahead and just grab a couple and hug and I are going to do a face mask together. So I got the Yes to Tomatoes Clear Skin Acne Fighting Paper Mask and I actually got two of these which looks like this. This Yes To brand, as we all know, is very, very popular and it's a well-known established brand. So I went ahead and I grabbed two of these and I do have acne prone skin, as you guys know. Hubs' skin is actually like close to perfect <laughs> if I'm being like completely honest with you he never really breaks out like he has like one or two pimples every now and then but he never really breaks out and I want to say his skin like his face skin is more normal if anything it's like dry to normal but it's not oily like mine and then this one I picked up for myself this is the yes to tomatoes clear skin detoxifying charcoal acne fighting t-zone mask so this is perfect for us oily skin people who are acne prone because this is specifically for your t-zone area which tends to be the area that gets the most oily so i'm really really excited to try this out i don't know why i only got one of these to be honest with you because this seems perfect for me but i cannot wait to try it out regardless and then this next item that i got i just got these sensitive baby wipes you do get 60 here to a pack this may or may not be a better value at Walmart. I don't know how much the baby wipes are at Walmart for the price point, but like I said, I was in Dollar Tree, so I went ahead and I just grabbed these. I love using baby wipes. They're just perfect to feel fresh, and they're just perfect to take with you on the go. They're good to just wipe yourself up after you do it number one or number two, just to help you feel fresh and clean. Like these are just really, really, really good to have, and they're good for your behind. They're good for her. Like they're just good all around. You know what I mean? So I do like to get baby wipes, and like I said, I was there, so I went ahead and I grabbed those. And then similarly, I grabbed these. I've never tried these before, nor have I ever tried anything related to this before. This is the Maxi Thins Feminine Cleansing Cloths for Sensitive Skin. I have been seeing this a lot in people's um, Dollar Tree haul videos. And apparently this is like really popular. Like a lot of people love this stuff and it's comparable to the Summer's Eve Cloths. Now, like I said, I've never tried feminine cleansing cloths specifically. I usually just always use baby wipes, but I am excited to go ahead and give these a try. You do get 32 cleansing cloths in here. They're pH balanced, alcohol free, hypoallergenic, and they're dermatologist tested. And I don't know where these are made. I should have honestly looked before I picked these up. But yeah, so these are perfect, especially during that time of the month, which mine's coming up next week. So that's why I kind of just wanted to stock up on these things. So that's why I'm really excited to go ahead and give these a try. Okay, so we are almost done here, you guys. Almost, almost done. I needed more dryer sheets for Hubs' laundry. So I just grabbed this box of the bounce dryer sheets. The bounce dryer sheets 
they're my ride or die I've always loved these I grew up on these my mom always used these growing up and she still does so I've noticed though that they actually changed the amount of dryer sheets that they sell at the Dollar Tree because I've had boxes of um, the bounce dryer sheets from Dollar Tree from a couple years ago and the count is 34 and now they sell these with 15 dryer sheets in them so that's like more than half <laughs> that they've cut the amount of dryer sheets in here and I don't know why that's really interesting though but yeah so now they come in 15 as opposed to before which was 34 I don't know what's happening but I decided to grab those because I needed them and then guys I finally found toilet paper yes this is as good as gold nowadays I swear <laughs> so this is the Dollar Tree toilet paper I've never tried these before but honestly as long as they say two ply which this one is the two ply like I'm here for it so I went ahead and I grabbed two of these and you do get four rolls in each one now like I said I am a couponer so usually the stock up price for toilet paper rolls is 25 cents each roll and these happen to be 25 cents each roll so this is really 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 a good deal so I grabbed two of the Dollar Tree ones and then I grabbed one of these this is the Scott Comfort Plus and this is just the regular roll, so they're a little bit smaller from what you normally see, but it doesn't matter, it's still 25 cents a roll, it's still gonna do the job, you know what I mean? And for a dollar, you really, really, really cannot beat that for Scott Brand. So I went ahead and I grabbed one of those. And then the last item that I have to share with you guys in this haul is another mask. <laughs> so this one is the Global Beauty Care Gold Spa Treatment Mask. And it says offers oh why did I get this I don't think I should have gotten this one because it says offers intense hydration to revitalize smooth and soften skin I don't need hydration <laughs> I don't need hydration because my skin's oily but it's fine it's fine if anything I'll just have hubs use this one and give it a try but yeah so this one doesn't say where it's made so I don't know if this one's made in the USA but yeah I have no idea but I went ahead and I picked it up it's in this really really fancy packaging and I'm just I'm intrigued to see how this works Whew. okay so finally we reached the end of this Dollar Tree haul for some reason I feel like that took a lot longer than anticipated so I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'm really really excited that again you guys welcome hygiene related content aside from Victoria's Secret and Bath and Body Works if any of you guys have tried out these products please let me know how you enjoyed them or if you enjoyed them down below in the comments and I'm sorry if my voice is starting to sound shaky it's my throat's actually getting a little bit dry so with that being said I'm gonna go ahead and go and I will chit chat with you guys in my next video. Peace!